Hallelujah. Glory be to the name of the Lord for another beautiful day. We we'll thank the name of the Lord for making it possible for us to see the seventh day of the month of March, year 2023. Beloved, begin to appreciate the Lord. Glorify this name, worship him for his mercy and glory forever. Thank him for all that he has done, all that he will do, all that he will continue to do in your life. Begin to appreciate him, begin to worship him, begin to magnify him. Thank you, Lord, we bless your name, we worship you. Lord, we give you glory. Lord, we worship your name. Lord, we magnify you. Lord, we praise you. You are worthy of all praise. You are worthy to be adored. You are the excellent God. Father, we thank you. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. I want you to also appreciate the Lord for your family. Thank the name of the Lord for what God has been doing in your family in your community, in the state, in the country as a whole. Let's appreciate the Lord, worship Him. Open your mouth and begin to bless the name of the Lord. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In case you are joining us for the first time, this is High Voltage Prayer Program. And this is a Midnight Prayer Program. The Almighty God has been using this program to ignite fire and a lot of people pray out. It has been... Uh, an avenue of many people getting connected to power and many of them receiving deliverance, receiving healing and mighty wonders of God through the programs. I pray that God also will visit you today to minister to your needs and every bondage in your life that is totally contending with your destiny shall be broken in the name of Jesus Christ. Let's sing, along, let's sing this hymn together. I'm pressing on Thou upward way, new height I'm gaining. Every day, still praying as I'm all ground. Lord, plant my feet on higher ground. Lord, lift me up. And let me stand by faith on earth, Bush land, high I have plain than I have found. Love plant my feet on higher ground. May the Almighty God plant our feet on higher ground in the name of Jesus Christ. You are welcome to this month of moving to a higher ground, moving into greatness, marching into higher level, marching into the uh, uh, palace of greatness. I welcome you that the Almighty God will empower you as you pray together. And we shall receive a uh, common breakthrough in the name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth and pray this prayer. Say, blood of Jesus, envelope my life in the mighty name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelope my life in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelope my life in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelope my life in the name of Jesus. Blood of Jesus, envelope my life. Envelope my life. Envelope my life. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, I recover myself. From every evil diversion in the name of Jesus. I recover myself from every evil diversion in the name of Jesus. I recover myself from every evil diversion in the name of Jesus. I recover myself from every evil diversion in Jesus' name. We pray. Do not forget that this prayer program covers two days, the seventh and the eighth day. So you have to take your time and pray this prayer effectively. I know that you are going to have testimony. Uh, I say, I refuse to be removed from divine agenda in the name of Jesus. I refuse to be removed from divine agenda in the name of Jesus. I refuse to be removed from divine agenda in the name of Jesus. I refuse to be removed from divine agenda in the name of Jesus. I refuse to be removed from divine agenda in Jesus' name. We pray. Say, every destiny, every destiny destroyer. Assigned against my life, 
ah, in the name of Jesus. Every destiny destroyer assigned against my life. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Every destiny destroyer assigned against my life. Ah, in Jesus' name. We pray. Say every witchcraft power working against my destiny. Fall down and die. In the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft power working against my destiny. Fall down and die. In the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft power working against my destiny. Fall down and die. In the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft power working against my destiny. Fall down and die. In Jesus' name we pray. Say strong man. Assigned to cage my destiny. Use your hood. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Strong man. Assigned to cage my destiny. Lose your hood. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Strong man. Assigned to cage my destiny. Lose your hood. Ah, in Jesus' name we pray. If you are a businesswoman or you are a businessman, I want you to pray this prayer very well. Say every negative dream. Assigned to drain money from my business. Be cancelled by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every negative dream. Assigned to drain money from my business. Be cancelled by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every negative dream. Assigned to drain money from my business. Be cancelled by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus name we pray. Say any power. Attacking the glory of my business. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Any power. Attacking the glory of my business. Ah, in the name of Jesus, any power attacking the glory of my business. Ah, in Jesus' name, we pray. You are going to pray this next one very well. Say, any strong man attached to my business. Ah, in the name of Jesus, any strong man attached to my business. Ah, in the name of Jesus, any strong man attached to my business. Ah, in Jesus' name, we pray. Thank you, Father. Say all those that gather together to hinder my moving forward be disgraced by fire in the name of Jesus. All those that gather together to hinder my moving forward be disgraced by fire in the name of Jesus. All those that gather together to hinder my moving forward be disgraced by fire in the name of Jesus. All those that gather together to hinder my moving forward be disgraced by fire. Be disgraced by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Every handwriting of household wickedness on my destiny be roasted by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every handwriting of household wickedness on my destiny be roasted by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every handwriting of household wickedness on my destiny be roasted by the blood of Jesus be roasted by the blood of Jesus be roasted by the blood of Jesus in Jesus name we pray I wipe off all those and writing today in the name of Jesus Christ say every stubborn pursuer of my breakthrough fall down and die in the name of Jesus every stubborn pursuer of my breakthrough fall down and die in the name of Jesus every stubborn pursuer of my breakthrough fall down and die in the name of Jesus, every stubborn pursuer of my breakthrough, fall down and die. In the name of Jesus, every stubborn pursuer of my breakthrough, fall down and die. In Jesus' name, we pray. Lay your hand upon your head and say, Every buried destiny, come alive now. In the name of Jesus, every buried destiny, come alive now. In the name of Jesus, every buried destiny, come alive now. In the name of Jesus, every buried destiny. Come alive now in the name of Jesus. Every buried destiny, come alive now in Jesus' name. We pray. Aha. Uh -huh. Say it again. Say every buried virtue, come alive now in the name of Jesus. Every buried virtue, come alive now in the name of Jesus. Every buried virtue, come alive now in the name of Jesus. Every buried virtue, come alive now in Jesus' name. We pray. Take your time to pray that prayer very well. Every buried destiny, come alive now. Every buried virtue come alive now. Uh -huh. Say every darkness covering the glory of my destiny disappear in the name of Jesus. Every darkness covering the glory of my destiny disappear in the name of Jesus. Every darkness covering the glory of my destiny disappear in the name of Jesus. Every darkness 
covering the glory of my destiny disappear in the name of Jesus. Every darkness covering the glory of my destiny disappear in the name of Jesus. Every darkness covering the glory of my destiny disappear in Jesus' name we pray. Now get a bottle of water and a bottle of oil. Father, we thank you for the bottle of water and the bottle of oil. I decree by the decree of the Lord that both the water and the oil shall become an instrument of power, shall become an instrument that break every yoke of darkness. This shall become an instrument of deliverance, the anointing for signs and wonders, the anointing of healing, the anointing of deliverance. We move inside this oil and the water, and immediately this oil and this water is being used. There will be manifestation of the power of God. There will be great testimony. In Jesus' name we pray. Now anoint your head. Anoint your head now. Thank you, Father. Now lay your hand on that on that head with the oil. You will pray this prayer three times. Say every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, pray. Second time, let's go. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, pray. This is the third time. Say, every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of sorrow be broken by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, pray. Drink a little of the water and anoint your chest. Lay your hand on your chest. Uh -huh. Say every covenant of infirmity be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of infirmity be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of infirmity be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of infirmity be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant of infirmity be broken by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name, pray. Anoint your stomach area and lay your hand there. You will say every covenant with family idol be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant with family idol be broken by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every covenant with family idol be broken, be broken, be broken, be broken. In Jesus' name we pray. Say my destiny. You will not be put to shame. In the name of Jesus. My destiny. You will not be put to shame. In the name of Jesus. My destiny. You will not be put to shame in the name of Jesus. My destiny. You will not be put to shame in the name of Jesus. My destiny. You will not be put to shame in Jesus' name. We pray. Anoint your two hands and stretch it forward. You will decree. You will decree and pray like this. Say the key of my breakthrough in the hand of the strong man be released by fire in the name of Jesus. The key of my breakthrough in the hand of the strong man. Release, 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 release it by fire. This the key of my breakthrough in the hand of the strong man. Release it by fire. Release it by fire. Release it by fire. Be release it by fire. Release it by fire. The key of my breakthrough in the hand of the strong man. Release it by fire. Release it by fire. Release it by fire. Release it by fire. In Jesus' name, we pray. You may need to spend quality time on that prayer, and you will see what the Lord will do. Thank you, Father. A uh, few days ago. Uh, we've been talking on disgracing anti breakthrough power. Specifically, we are praying prayer against anti breakthrough powers. We were able to understand that everybody desires breakthrough. God also wants us to prosper. It is the desire of God that all of us should prosper. Is it the desire of God? that all of us should break through. It is the desire of God that all of us should experience enlargement. All of us should experience advancement. All of us should experience progress. All of us should experience moving to the next level. That is the desire of God for every one of us. 
you know, it's a desire of God that we should also prosper. You know, the Bible says something very unique that I love so much, revealing the desire of God that every one of us should prosper. You know, he said, let them shout for joy and be glad and favor my righteous cause. Ye, let them say continually, let the Lord be magnified, which has pleasure in the prosperity of its servant. God has pleasure in the prosperity of his servant. So God is happy when he sees his children prospering. You know, when he sees them breaking forth, when he sees them expressing breakthrough. But there are powers that the enemy had also, you know, given the assignment to, to hinder breakthrough, to work against breakthrough. When we identify these kind of powers and we pray aggressively against them, they will clear off from the road. They will clear off from the way and we enter into our breakthrough. So our own is to experience victory over anti-breakthrough powers. We need to experience victory over anti-breakthrough powers. And for you to experience that victory, you must disgrace all these anti-breakthrough power. You must challenge them. David challenged Goliath. Goliath was a strong man in the breakthrough of the people of Israel. And David challenged him, confronted him, and pulled him down. The head of your own Goliath too will be released into your hand in the name of Jesus Christ. Now get ready as we are going to pray. Confess your sin unto the Lord. Tell the Lord to show you mercy so that there won't be any hindrance to your prayer. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we pray. Now, we have examined the number one cause. We said number one is secret sin. Secret sin will hinder breakthrough. Number two is curses. A curse will limit someone. A curse will bring an embargo on the destiny of somebody, of someone. A curse will reduce the speed that the person needs to make. A curse will fight breakthrough. A curse will oppose blessing. A curse will oppose break prosperity. A curse will not make anyone to experience breakthrough. So we must fight against any curse assigned against our breakthrough. The third one is the strong man. The Bible says, is it possible for anyone to enter into the room or the palace of the strong man and collect his gift, his stolen gift, or his goods? If not first, buy the strong man, then he enter into the palace and collect the goods. The goods that the strong man kept in his palace, kept in his room, they are not his own. He had stolen them from people and he kept them. When you want to collect what belongs to you, you have to challenge the strong man. Matthew 12, 29, you have to challenge the strong man, confront him to release all that belongs to you and he will forcefully release them. So a strong man is an anti-breakthrough power. A strong man is the principle of all demons confronting you. A strong man will stand against people's breakthrough until you deal with them. So it's our duty to deal with that strong man now. To deal with that strong man now. A man, sorry, a woman, employ a house help. But she did not know that this house help was a strong man contending with the family, making the family to experience miserable things. Finances of the family drain out. Sick children were falling sick. Things were not moving forward at all. It was so terrible that the husband died in this process. It was after this that the woman started praying. And in the course of the prayers, she got to know that this house is a strong man. And the house confessed too. 
that she was sent into their family to waste their family. You are going to pray. Open your mouth and shout this prayer with aggression. Say every power assigned to waste my family. Die in the name of Jesus. Every power assigned to waste my family. Die, 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 die. In Jesus' name. Please say strong man of darkness living with me. And on assignment to waste my family. Ah, in the name of Jesus, strong man of darkness, living with me, and on assignment to waste my family. Ah, in the name of Jesus, strong man of darkness, living with me, and on assignment to waste my destiny. Ah, in Jesus, they will say, strong man of darkness, among my workers, be disgraced by fire. In the name of Jesus, strong man of darkness, among my workers, be disgraced, be disgraced, be disgraced. In Jesus' name, we pray. Say every power flying against my breakthrough, fall down and die. In the name of Jesus, every power flying against my breakthrough, fall down and die. In the name of Jesus, every power flying against my breakthrough, fall down and die. In Jesus' name, we pray. One of the things that the anti breakthrough power used to do is to stagnate people, to limit people, to stagnate their progress. To sit on their destiny, to put embargo upon their lives. You will pray this prayer very well. There's something we call progress embargo. Instead of making breakthrough, you will see the thing returning back to square one. You are going to shout, say, Every internal power assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus, every internal power assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus, every internal power assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus, every internal power assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in Jesus' name, pray. One of the anti, <laughs> one of the voices of the anti breakthrough is no. Anti breakthroughs, we say no to people's breakthrough. They will hinder people from moving forward. These are dangerous power. We need divine intervention. I want you to pray these three prayer points with aggression and with power. Say, how so wickedness assigned to hinder my progress? Ah, in the name of Jesus. How so wickedness assigned to hinder my progress? Ah, in the name of Jesus. How so wickedness assigned to hinder my progress? Ah, in Jesus' name, pray. Say, every evil power of my father's house. Assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Every evil power of my father's house. Assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Every evil power of my father's house. Assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in Jesus' name. We pray. Say every evil power of my mother's house. Assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus. Every evil power of my mother's house. Assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus, every evil power of my mother's house assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in the name of Jesus, every evil power of my mother's house assigned against my breakthrough. Ah, in Jesus' name, pray. Say, unfriendly friends walking against my breakthrough be disgraced and be exposed. Ah, uh-huh. unfriendly friends walking against my breakthrough be exposed and be disgraced. In the name of Jesus, unfriendly friends walking against my breakthrough, be exposed and be disgraced. 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 Unfriendly friends walking against my breakthrough, be exposed and be disgraced. Be exposed and be disgraced. Be exposed and be disgraced. In Jesus' name, we pray. Every foundational power contending against my moving forward, fall down and die. Pray that prayer very well. Every foundational power contending against my moving forward, fall down and die. Fall down and die. Fall down and die. In the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer for about five minutes and you will see what the Lord will do. Thank you, Father. There is somebody that is hearing me now. You are on the sick bed. Lay your hand upon your chest and you will see this prayer. Say, every sickness in my body Sponsored by household wickedness, get out by fire. 
When you pray that prayer for about five minutes, note, just look at yourself, you'll be fully whole. Father, I pray for that woman. As you pray that prayer, let the power of God fall upon you. And that sickness put into your body by household wickedness shall go back to the sender. In Jesus' name we pray. Father, we thank you for what you have done. We bless your name. We give all the glory for the wonders and power. We pray that every material of household enemy in our lives we challenge you go back to the sender in the name of Jesus Christ. Wickedness of household enemy, we command you to expire today in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Aha. I prophesy to your life, you will experience uncommon breakthrough. That sister here, the word of the Lord. My God will bless you in a new way that the yoke of poverty is broken in your life forever in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray for as many people who have been who have been crying that the Lord should visit them this month of March. Receive divine visitation in the name of Jesus Christ. You shall experience marital breakthrough. You shall experience conception breakthrough. You will experience business breakthrough. You will experience financial breakthrough. You will experience career breakthrough in the name of Jesus Christ. All those waiting for their document to be released, receive it today in the name of Jesus Christ. That sister, you have been rejected three times at the embassy. By the time you go back there now, the Lord has made a way for you. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Thank you, Lord. Aha. Aha. There is a big warehouse that I can see now. In that warehouse, there are goods there. But all the goods in that warehouse, there's an embargo on them. So that is why that man, you have been experiencing very terrible losses. Go to that warehouse and say, blood of Jesus, laminate all the goods in the warehouse. You will see what the Lord will do. Thank you, Father. Somebody went for burial of the mother, and since you came back, you have experienced total downfall. Total downfall, bankruptcy in every area. Financially, you are down. Go straight for prayer for three days. Challenge every envious enemy. Command their arrow fire against you to go back to the center. Those who have taken your name to evil altar, they shall be disgraced. And you will recover fully. Thank you, Father. God will give you power to capture your wealth back. In Jesus' name we pray. Aha. If God has blessed you, you have testimony to share with us. You have testimony to uh, tell us. God has ministered to your case. And you can now share testimony. You can get back to us on this WhatsApp number. If you have prayer requests, also get back to us on this WhatsApp number. 0802-336-9298. 0802-336-9298. I fellowship at Mountain of Fire Miracle Ministry. And our international headquarters is at number 13 on Last Symbol Street, Unique Saboya by Lagos, Nigeria. It's at the back of Second Gate of Uniland, 10 minutes drive from Queen's College. Our God is doing mighty wonders in this place through our Father and the Lord, Dr. D.K. Olukoya. Also, you can visit any of our churches, branches everywhere. They are closer to where you live. Just get to them, they will be of help to you. I remain your friend, Pastor Emmanuel. I can God bless you in Jesus' name.